to the pumpkin patch. Today is August 7th, 2022. And uh, plant number four here actually filled out pretty well. This is the one that I made the video on how to uh, train or steer the pumpkin vines. This is one of the main vines from the back. I call them the kicker coming out this way. And then the main vine coming this way that I trained to go off in this direction. Actually went quite a ways. I didn't bear it as much as I probably should have, but this wasn't so important to me. I had uh, other things I'm working on. It actually got a couple pumpkins coming off of it over here, which I just let go for now. The pumpkin itself actually got pretty big. What I'm definitely learning from this is I need to build shade for these or, you know, lay a sheet over them or whatever people do because you can definitely see how the sun coming up during the first part of the day hitting this side as compared to the other side. This side's all smooth as of this side is like rough and kind of bleached out and faded. And uh, the pumpkin I took down for the uh, fair for week four, the Orange County Fair, uh, it got first place and best of show. And I was pretty, uh, pretty amazed with all that. And then I realized looking at it, how smooth and clean it looks because that's the one I had under the shelter. So that was, I'm sure, had something to do with the, uh, the high scores plus the size and just it was an overall nice nice looking pumpkin so what we're doing today just a quick video pretty basic deal I'm going to eat the for the final week which is next week I'm going to take down pumpkin 1b here but when I'm when I'm harvesting it, which is in a few minutes here, I think what I'm going to do is cut it right here. Instead of just clipping all this apart and then pulling it out, I'm just going to cut it here, thereabouts, with this saw. And that way the main vine is undisturbed, basically, and still goes off in this direction because there's, there's still a pumpkin on there. No sense uh, destroying the plant to get this one pumpkin off of there. So anyway, this is the one that's going down for this next uh, this next week's and final week's competition, week five at George County Fair, Costa Mesa. It's got a pretty nice looking surface to it and whatnot, but like I just said, if I would have covered these up, build a little shade and whatnot, it would be uh, it'd be a little nicer, and actually it might be a little bigger. So lesson learned, still a big plant there. Most of the plants died out, but this became a huge plant. That's why I went ahead and put two, two pumpkins on this one. All right, thanks for watching.